Hey tubers, this is a quick Sunday update. There isn't much to update, so I'm just gonna rattle it off quick. Um, anybody who has bought more than 50 patch, uh, battery packs from me, um, I am having a horrible run with these batteries, and I'm talking some of them are just completely shit ass. Um, that's the pile of batteries I'm not gonna use as compared to the ba good batteries that I've got. Um, and that's just not good enough in my opinion. So anybody that's bought more than 50 batteries, battery packs, I will happily give you an extra 20 battery packs to make up for the, for the losses, I hope. Um, so if you've bought more than 20, uh, um, more than 50 battery packs off me, um, I will replace any wet or any generic or any prismatic if there is indeed any and I have heard a few um, cases unfortunately um, but I'm absolutely more than happy to replace anything that's not up to scratch um, and I'll give you an extra 20 packs on top of that so I hope that makes up for it um, also anybody that's bought one two three four or five or whatever and they've a similar thing again bring them back and I'll replace the bad ones so I hope that makes that better. Um, I haven't had any complaints except for myself and I'm not very happy, but it is what I did. I, I bought boxes and boxes and boxes of boxes of um, used batteries. Um, on that said, I think I've got another 480 battery packs coming tomorrow, which is Monday. And then I have a metric shit ton more than that coming sometime in the next two weeks. I'm talking thousands of batteries probably a lot more than that but that hasn't happened yet so we don't know right this mess okay this battery pack here is now within 17 millivolts so that's pretty much balanced now the seventh one isn't on there because the cable broke but it's pretty much the same so it's it's about 17 millivolts in between high and low which i'm I, i'm gonna say that that's a balanced pack now and that's my that's my a pack that's my good one um i've still yet to manually balance that one but i'm just i'm just bored i, ha I haven't i haven't spent any reasonable amount of time on any of these packs this week i've just been using me um imax to actually throw some extra charge into the batteries that are low and put a fan on the ones that are high and I just balanced them all out. It just gave me something to do more than anything else. Um, it's still all connected up. Now, well, there's not many updates, unfortunately. I really haven't done much. Also, this morning I've been um, moving this shed into place. So I've got some like railway sleeper type things. <coughs> Pardon me. Dug them into the ground, made a level base. Um, It'll have sand and concrete in there in the next week or so, but I haven't done that yet, so there's nothing to show you inside. Um, so basically, the way I think this is going to happen is you can't really see it, but just there is the PCM60X, which is the charge controller. I'm going to move that into the shed on that wall because behind my wood pile here, that orange cable, uh, orange conduit there. Um, actually comes over there and it's dug underneath the ground and over there so I'm going to dig that up um, and run it along the fence underneath the ground and then underneath then up the wall and that's where the power is going to come in and then um, I'll use this orange conduit here to run uh, I have I've ordered some more of this so I'm rudely interrupted by a phone call okay so I've got um, a heap more of this uh, conduit ordered I'm going to run three runs uh, one's going to be the negative cable from here One's going to be the positive cable from there to the um, inverter. I know you shouldn't have long runs of cables, but I don't care. This is how I'm doing it. I'm going to double it down. Um, or run some heavy welding cable or something. And it's only max draw is 100, 100 amps anyway, so it's not going to kill anything. Um, and I'm going to have a circuit breaker in here, and then I'll have a circuit breaker down there. And I'm, all, I'm going to move all of these batteries underneath there into the bottom of there. Um, I don't know whether I'm going to use them or not. I'm not going to mix chemistry them up, but I might have them there on a separate circuit just in case I need the extra power. So that's all the updates. Um, I still haven't got the the um, the mounts done. I will include a little picture just here of uh, the laser cutting that's been completed. 
Um, I've had it in my hands for less than five minutes before it went to the next fella to do his thing, to fold it up and get some measurements and stuff. So, that's it. That'll be my update until the next one. I'll see you later. Cheers, guys. Thank you.